Hello and welcome back. This is video number five, common blocks. So there's a category of blocks called common blocks that you saw earlier. So let's go ahead and go over it now. Okay, so up at the top, if we click on the add block, now remember, most use tends to be the blocks that you use. Now, if we click here, common blocks are different. Common blocks are based upon the most common blocks for WordPress across the board. So these are the common blocks that they have found <laughs> to be common. So we've got paragraph, we've got image, we've got gallery, we've got heading, list, quote, file, audio, cover, and video. So WordPress has figured out that the majority of people will use these blocks. So if we click on paragraph, let's just go in depth. I know I covered a little bit of this in the previous videos, but let's just go further. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a paragraph here. So we're gonna click paragraph. This is a test. So Paragraph is most likely going to be the body of your article. So we can left align, we can center align, we can right align, we can bold, italicize, hyperlink, and there are some more here. So these are basically what we went over earlier, so I'm not gonna go over that now. But over here, we can see paragraph. So we can highlight that. Under the paragraph, right hand side we have text settings so you can change the font size so let's say we're like this is too small so let's change it from normal size to medium size or let's change it to huge and we're like okay this is way too big let's make it small so that allows you to change the size as such but you can also change the size like with this so here's about numbers so you can do custom so these are specific sizes but you can say okay I want something in between large and huge so we got large and huge so we can see large is 36 huge is 48 so there's still a gap between these two so let's say I want something like 40 Drop cap, if we highlight the beginning word or beginning letter and we click on drop cap, this is what you see a lot of times in magazines. So it just makes it a little more professional. It looks good. All right. So there's actually studies that show that the human eye, when they see a drop cap, they look upon it and think, oh, this must be legit or this must be important because it looks like a magazine or a newspaper. Now we have color settings which allows you to change the background color like this. So if we scroll down we can see that it changes the background color and this is something that you could not have done with the classic editor. So this is a big pro. So we can change it to this. So you don't want to choose something that's just too much in your face like this unless you know your audience and you know that's the colors that you want to use. Or maybe that fits your brand. Your Maybe your brand colors are pink and blue. You could do something like that. All right, so we're going to choose, let's gray, and we can choose red, blue, like that. And you got custom color, which allows you to pick a color that might not be on this list. So let's say we're going to clear this. When we clear it, it removes the background. We can click custom color and it allows you to choose different colors that may not be on this list. You can do the same with the text color. So we can clear that and let's say we don't like the dark blue. We can click custom color and we can choose a different color that's not on that list like, like so. And under advanced, you have CSS class, but if you don't know anything about CSS, you can simply ignore that. 
So that's it when it comes to the paragraph block. All right, so let's scroll down and let's go ahead and add a new block. So if we go to common blocks, we have images. So images are, and then we have galleries. So this one down here is an image, so we'll click that. Now image is very self-explanatory. We briefly touched base on this, but all you have to do is simply upload. You can go to media library, or you can insert from an existing URL that is linking to an image. So either of those choices, you can choose the image will show up and that's it. So it's very, very self-explanatory. And then of course you have gallery, which is the same, but it's just multiple images versus one image. So let's go here. Let's add a new block or common blocks. So we went from paragraph image gallery. We got heading, which we touched base earlier. So you can change the size, the heading size, and the alignment to the right. We covered list actually earlier. So if we go to list, list doesn't have any settings on the side. It just allows you to create an unordered list, a ordered list, and do indentations to the left or the right, bold and italicize. So very, very easy to set up. So we went over quotes. We actually created one. Quotes is simple. You just click quote. You enter text. So quotes up here too. So you can change the styles. You can make it large like that or make it small. Typically, what you'll notice is quotes typically will look like more like this. They'll have big, they'll, they'll be italicized. And it'll be qu quite obvious to people that that is a quote. You have advanced, but like I say, most of you will not use advanced. So you don't have to even click that. So next off on common blocks, we have, we went through these, we went through these. If you click on audio, very similar, you upload the audio file as an MP3 file and that's it. It's done. It's very, very similar to images. We'll click this here, common blocks. And then we pretty much went through all of these videos, very similar. You just have to have the video in hand on your computer. You upload it to the media library, you upload it, or you get the URL. We have file, which is again, similar. If you click on file, same thing very similar to audio, video, and image, and gallery. And of course, the last one is the cover. So the cover is also very, very similar. And the cover, you typically you wanna have it at the top. So that, and you just upload an image and that's it. Of course, when you're done, you want to click publish and you're good to go.